Ah, the life of villainy is most exciting, is it not, Paisania? If I want flashing lights, I go to the discotheque. In moments, the experimental prototype inside will be ours. Oh, could you not simply buy this fancy prototype online? You and your internet. Some things are best done the old-fashioned way, Junior. Senor, senior, senior. Ah, oh, impossible. My feisty teen nemesis. You complete me. Don't forget me! Oh, yes, of course. Run, stoppable. Yeah, I'm not so good with the faces. Surrender, senor, senior. Senior? I most respectfully decline. Well played. Impossible. Well played. But the next time, you will not be so lucky. Until then, be well! Bad man. Good manners. Out of green guppy. Like a total red ferret. Okay, at a fork in the road, you stop. Kim, I need some advice. You are about to embark on a journey that will utterly change your life. What snacks would you bring along? Don't tell me you got sucked in by this animology craze. Craze? I think not. Animology is a window into your innermost self. Ron, it's a lame cross between astrology and a personality quiz. Not even close. Animology assigns you a color and an animal. It's science, Kim. Thanks, but I have a life. It predicts your perfect mate. Tell me you don't want to know your perfect mate. Not if he's some blue baboon. Don't even joke, Kim. A blue baboon would be disastrous for you. Uh, I pass on the fad, Ron. Okay, let's get started. Do you mind? Some of us are trying to concentrate. I cannot wait to unlock my innermost self. I would prefer to unlock that vault in the weapons research facility. Oh dear, here comes that pompous Philippe. Philippe Bouillon. Oh, won't you join us for some lunch? My pleasure, senor, senior, senior. You so rarely make it to the club these days. I have an active retirement. Indeed. I understand your latest hobby is quite unique. Uh, father wants to conquer the world. Well, who doesn't? But the Billionaires Club prizes discretion and... Obscenely large personal fortunes. I assure you, Philippe, though my pastime is pricey, I still possess the requisite billions for club membership. Of course. We checked. Well, then how can I help you? Senor, a member in a melee with an American cheerleader? It reflects, how shall I say, poorly on the club. What are you saying, Philippe? That I am revoking your club membership. I'll take that. Amelia! Over here! I heard you're a lavender mouse. I'm a red otter. Major conflict. I finished the animology test. Let me guess. Blue baboon? Worse. I'm a pink sloth, Kim. A pink sloth? Sloth! The lowest of the low! The pink sloth is an outcast, a follower, socially inept, and smells of overripe fruit. I do not smell of overripe fruit. <laughs> I wonder if they have a pink naked mole rat. <gasps> Ron, your stupid book! Hmm. You arrive at the multiplex only to find that the movie you've come to see is sold out. Hmm. 
Father, if I was a tree, which tree do you think I would be? Ah, one that would be banned for the billionaire club, Junior. This insult leaves me no choice but revenge. There are other clubs for the obscenely wealthy. Not the point. World-class villains are defined by disproportionate revenge. Perhaps I engineer a crash of financial markets that freezes the club's assets. <laughs> that would require a large freezer. I was not speaking literally, my son. Was I? Let's eat. What is taking him so long? Well, she's working on some big test. Didn't catch the subject. This should not be this hard. If the movie I want to see is sold out, I leave. But that makes me seem stubborn. I'll see something else. That's flexible. Or it could mean I'm weak. Kimmy, aren't you coming down to dinner? Just start without me, Mom. I'm totally swamped. What exactly is swamping you? Animology. It says what kind of person you are. No, not that I believe it. It's, it's just for laughs. Sounds like fun. I'll put your plate in the microwave. Thanks, Mom. I'll just be a few. Go to bed, Kim. Night, Mom. Love you. A mysterious stranger calls your name. You're most likely to. I'm a blue fox, Dad. Uh, super. Did you know that the blue fox is a born leader? Can't resist a challenge. Driven to excel. A perfectionist. That explains the all-nighter. All the phone! The perfect soulmate of the blue fox is the yellow trout. Soulmate. I think Kimmy's a bit young to be looking for a soulmate. Or any kind of mate. In a few days, Kimmy will have forgotten all about yellow trouts. This whole animology business is just a silly teen fad. Hmm. If you say so. So, uh... What are you? Teal cat. You? Beige raccoon. Soulmate! And I'm a yellow bear, which is cool. Doesn't you that hottie who sits next to me in English is a yellow rabbit? Right, KP. Animology is completely bogus. <laughs> bogus. I don't know if I'd go that. Because there's no way Ron Stoppable is a pink sloth. Here, yeah, I have that info you wanted. Oh, no big. Just give it to me later. But you said it was the highest priority. Utmost rush. Whenever's fine. No, 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 no. Go ahead, Wade. Important news will be a welcome break from this animology garbage. Okay, I checked all school databases, Kim. But there's no way to tell who's a yellow trout. You took the test? I'm a blue fox. I can't resist a challenge. I can't believe you are into animology. I am not into it, Ron. I took the test for laughs. No big. <gasps> Who's the yellow trout? So into it. Still looking. But you did get an interesting hit on the site. From Pop Pop Porter. Who? Shame on you, KP. Pop Pop is the genius who revolutionized the heat and eat snack industry. Pop Pop's mini corn dogs? Nature's perfect food. Have you ever read what's in them? That would be stupid. I avoid fried foods. Never fried. Flash frozen. Streaming the video. Now, need your help, little lady. Someone stole my state-of-the-art flash freezer cryovator. No flash freezer? That means no mini corn dogs. No bite-sized goodness? No! Pull yourself together, Wade, and get me the down low on this cryovator. I have this commercial. Are you hungry? Then dive right in. Are mini corn dogs or a man's best friend? These bites of doggies are sure to please. Made from Pop-Pop's corny secret recipe. We flash freeze flavors, that's why they're guaranteed. Pop-Pop orders mini corn dogs. And flash frozen flavor, folks. Oh, you gotta love little corn doggy. Yeah. Okay, we'll need a ride. Pop-Pop's on it. <laughs> Little corn doggy. Here we are, little lady. The scene of the crime. <laughs> Do you smell that? Are you feeling right, son? It's too heinous for words. I just love your product. Don't do that. It smells so familiar. Wait, I need an air quality analysis. Activating all factory sensors. The real shame is these little doggies will go to waste <laughs> unless somebody eats them. And soon. Oh. Go, Wade. That's 
that smell? Cologne. Very expensive. Custom blended for an exclusive clientele. Guess who's on the list? Senor Senior Junior. Right. The senior's plan is pure evil. Wait until the world is in a mini corn dog famine and then make us pay. Pay big. Senor Seniors after something bigger than mini corn dogs. What could be bigger than mini corn dogs? You are such a pink sloth. One, animology is bogus. And two, seniors after corn dogs. It's not, it's not. Look at this lair. He's all about big crimes. Mini corn dogs. Crime. Corn dog. Crime. Ron, look. The cryovator. Snack thief. The clone. Ah, Kim Possible. And so our little game of cat and mouse goes on, huh? Are we the cat or the mouse? <laughs> mouse. But we were stalking you. That's caddish, my friend. This is a good point. No, it's not. Let the corn dogs go, Senor Senior. Dear boy, this is not about tiny breaded sausages. Mm -hmm. You blue foxes think you know everything. Blue fox? You study the animology? Oh, please, Junior, do not start. The time has come to prove my villain's metal. First, I will flash freeze you. You don't need to prove anything to us. Well, that is very kind, but it is part of my plan. You understand. <laughs> Next, I will freeze the billionaire's club from which I was so rudely ejected. You're doing all this just to tweak some other rich guys? Yes, wonderful, isn't it? You can freeze us, but there's no way that Papa Porter's little cryovator can freeze an entire building. Well, actually, it's more of an island, which is why we studied Pop Pop's cryovation technology to create this. That ought to do it. Do you realize the jumbo mini corn dogs you could flash freeze with? Ow! Oh, I will miss a fearsome rivalry, Kim Possible. Come, Junior. Junior! Father! I am the Yellow Trout! No! Junior's a Yellow Trout? Gross! Uh, KP, don't you think we have bigger problems? My perfect match cannot be Senor Senior Junior. Oh, I'm sure you'll be real happy together. If he can defrost you... Rufus? Push the red button! He's too light! Rufus, look in my pocket! Snarf him! Rodent. <laughs> Corn dogs, rock! Why can't I feel my feet? I've got footsicles! Maybe if I. What? We need to find something that will get us to the billionaire's club. I think we'll manage. He says that Senor Senior Junior is my soulmate. I say forget animology. Done and done. Rufus! <laughs> Buddy, you all right? <laughs> well, he knows he's not welcome here. Senor Senior Senior won't. Darken our door again. Release the tether line, Junior. Junior! It says the yellow trout cares only about himself. Make that sound like a bad thing. Activate the solar panels. Initiate freezer stacker. I am revolting your claw! 
Julian. My perfect match is the blue fox. I would like to know this blue fox person. Wait, what have you got? It's giant cryovator solar power. No plug to pull. So what can we do? Destroy it? Follow the money? Did we not leave Kim Possible on a conveyor belt to her doom? Yes, a proper villain always leaves his fall when he's about to expire. Why? Well, it would be bad form just to loll about waiting for it. Why? Tradition! She's really testing my patience, this Kim Possible. Help! Anybody? I'll get you! Okay, this is gonna get a little warm. No! You wouldn't want to dash in and fetch my caviar, would you? I thought not. Look out! Why did you not just aim the laser at their bodies? Junior, if you do not understand these traditions of villainy, I have failed as a father. You blue foxes think you know everything. Farewell, Kim Possible. It's been, as you say, a blast. You blue foxes, blue foxes, blue foxes. No! You must not harm my blue fox! Get down! Do you understand why I am angry? Kim Possible, you are the blue fox! I am the yellow trout! We are meant to be! We are... Soulmates! Junior, dating an arch foe is... Spitting upon villain tradition. But father! Back to the lair with you. Tradition dictates we must begin to plot our revenge immediately. Wow. I think my blue foxiness just saved us. That was weird. I guess animology isn't all bad. Huh? Wade? Morning, Kim. Did you get the flowers? Uh, yeah? There's an e-card. I'll stream. My blue fox. I count the hours until my father's criminal activities bring us near again. That is so beautiful. <laughs> and so, Yellow Trout, I don't want to hear another word about animology. Ron Stoppable is no pink sloth. Whew, that's a relief. A pink sloth is supposed to be my soulmate. So, Amelia! Wait, I'm a textbook sloth! Outcast, followers, socially inept! I smell like corn dogs! We're made for each other! <laughs>